What is up, Sooner Nation? Welcome back to another edition of You Got It Right, uh, Sooner Women's Basketball Game Recap as the Sooners uh, beat an in-state, I guess you could say rival, but in-state opponent in Oral Roberts, winning going away 103-74. to Before we get started, if you aren't subscribed, maybe you're new to this channel uh, following OU Women's Basketball, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel, turn on your notifications, like and comment as we cover all things Sooner Sports. Let's get right into it. I thought today, very impressive win, uh, stacking another win on top of uh, a, a huge road win that they had uh, earlier in the week to, to come back home, uh, get with all the, uh, I guess you could say, distractions that could have been uh, coming back home. Sooners win going away, 103 to 74. And Peyton Rollholst was amazing, five for five from three ball. Uh, Sooners score over 100 points, which, I mean, you can't say this is an exciting basketball to watch, guys. Just a great performance again by Jenny Baranchet's crew. Yeah, they got some pretty good shooters. Peyton Volholz, Lexi Keys, Sierra yeah. Williams. Yeah, oh, yeah, they do. They got, and you know, they're out still without Liz Scott. Uh, and uh, just wait. I mean, here's the thing a lot of people could have said after the big win on the road, ranked team, that you come home and you have a letdown. And a letdown may not be a loss, but a letdown may be squeaking by with the W, not looking great doing it. But guys, they 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 thoroughly dominated. I mean, 103 points, like you said, uh, whatever it was. I mean, great, exciting basketball. And if, I would encourage anybody that's in the area, if you can get to the games, get to the games. They're super fun to watch. They're exciting. Uh, the coach is energetic. I mean, it's great basketball. Great team basketball. They move the ball so well. Yeah, they they. I mean, shot I a lot of threes. I, Do you have the numbers they, on assists? No, I didn't. I didn't get the assist total. I'll have to look at the box either. score. Didn't get that either. But uh, a lot of three balls, and I tell you why. Uh, you, you talked about getting there and watching them. They do play Wednesday against. I think it's Alabama State, but it's like a ten thirty a.m. game in the morning. I thought that was interesting. But uh, Baranchek is growing uh, the fan base there in Norman. Okay, uh, she's doing a great job. She's yeah. not happy. Uh, she's not content with where they're at either, which is what I love. If you heard her in the post game, talked a lot about we're going to get better. People, I think the phrase she used was people keep asking and questioning, like, why, did, why do I keep saying we're going to be better? Because we are. We're going to get better day by day. Uh, she preaches that. Now, one area where they do need to be better at, Braden, is turnovers. Turnovers. They, they have 21 again today. So mm -hmm. this is two games in a row that they've continually uh, turned, have high numbers of turnovers. That should get better. Uh, as the season progresses, but that that is an area that could bite them later on, don't you think? Yes, for sure. Well, and you know, last week against Ole Miss, Miss they get, they get the W, but remember they didn't shoot very well at all from three in that game. Uh, so, I mean, the, obviously they still have things they need to work on. But look at look at transfer there from Louisville. Uh, I, I have a trouble pr pronouncing her name. Uh, the Earl one. Holst. Earl. Yeah. I mean, transfer, look at look at what she's doing. I mean, they got so many weapons. I think that's what's different. And, guys, women's basketball right now, uh, it's all fun to watch. Caitlin mm -hmm. Clark for Iowa is unbelievable. But you had last week, you had LSU get beat. Uh, so, it's open. Parody. I mean, parody, is, parody is here now in college basketball. Women's in college women's basketball, basketball. yes. I think, I think the really Sooners were 12 of 29 today. I might be wrong. I think they were 12 of 29 from three ball. Which is it's above thirty percent. Yeah. Uh, it's not not excellent, but it's it's around that's pretty I don't, good. That's pretty it's good. Not bad. Twelve of twenty nine. Of course, Peyton Verhols was five of five herself. So, yeah. <laughs> what else stood out to you, uh, Braden? Lexi Keys. Where's she, she from again, Braden? She's from Tahlequah. Yeah, I know, but she's also from OSU, which is hilarious. Yes, yeah. it's hilarious that OU has Trace Ford, uh, Lexi Keys. Kelly yeah. Maxwell, like seriously, OSU, you can't keep the best ones. What's going on? But I'm pretty – I like this new freshman, these two freshmen. One's a center and then one's a point guard. Now, Jowens, uh, Jowens had a good game today. Yes. And she had a good game against Ole Miss too. I think Jowens has had two really good games. Yeah. Jo oh, yeah, Ashley Jones. Or, yeah, Jones yeah. or Jowens. I it's J O E N S. I may be pronouncing it incorrectly. No, it's Jones. Okay. Yeah. So I mean, 
you, you've said it, Jay. They're up tempo. Uh, they, they shoot a lot of shots. Uh, they move the ball. They're athletic. They have way. I mean, they had four or five in double figures today. Last week they did well at Ole Miss. So it's they're not a one trick pony, not a two trick pony. They are very deep. They play a lot. Uh, I think they played what ten or eleven at Ole Miss and probably got more than that on on the floor today. So yeah. very exciting to watch. Another great win for the Sooners. I'll have to say Nevada Todd. Nevada Todd. Nevada Todd. Yeah. Yeah, and she what makes, does she bring? She makes that offense run the floor. Yeah. Hey, and and you know she's got another thing about Garanti. She's got a great staff. I mean, her staff is unbelievable. A lot of them know a lot of basketball. I believe Michael Neal is still on that staff, and he played at Oklahoma men's basketball. Um, but uh, you look at their schedule, like you said, Jeremy. You got the ten thirty tilt, but then on Sunday, next Sunday, road road game at Virginia. Uh, uh, you know, it's a, it's a power five school, so um, gives you another uh, good opportunity there. But uh, this team, I think, I, I don't know. The rankings come out tomorrow. They got to be ranked, do they not? I mean, yeah. uh, have to be ranked. Have to be. Be ranked. Have you, to you be. go on the road to Hottie Toddy and, and you just and you beat them when you didn't even play probably your best basketball. You still get that win. That's huge. And like you said, you back it up with the dominant performance today by over 25 points against Oral Roberts. Uh, how was the crowd? Could you guys tell today how the crowd was? I thought it was okay. I thought it was all right. Yeah, yeah I don't. I mean, I thought it was pretty good. You, you know, you talked about the 10-30 game, Jeremy. But a lot of times the women's basketball team does this a lot throughout the year some. And what they do is a lot of schools bring uh, classes and it actually get causes for a pretty good crowd on some of those games. So you also got the week before Thanksgiving. So uh, elementary schools and middle schools they're looking for excuse to get out of school and go on field trips. So yeah, get out to the LNC uh, this Wednesday, ten thirty, Alabama State. Uh, Jenny Baranchek uh, doing an amazing job right now with the women's basketball program. A uh, lot, a lot of great things happening, and a lot of great things happening here on the Sooner Surge because guys, we don't just cover. Uh, football. We cover all Sooner sports, and women's basketball is an area we're just now starting to pick up coverage on, so make sure you are subscribed to our channel. Uh, we will be doing game recaps after each game. We'll also be trying to add to the content with maybe some interviews and other things moving forward, so make sure you're a part of it. Sooners today get the win, 103-74 to against Oral Roberts Golden Eagles at the LNC. Again, Alabama State, 1030 a.m. on Wednesday. Till next time, guys. Boomer. Boomer. Sooner.